hey, allow me to lead with Isaiah 30, 18. It says, yet the Lord longs to be gracious to you. Therefore, he will rise up to show you compassion. For the Lord is a God of justice. Blessed are those who wait for him. Let me ask you this. What are your expectations of God? And I'll put it another way. Are you looking for God's goodness? Are you expecting his favor and believing to rise higher and trusting to accomplish what he has put in your heart? Or have you let circumstances suppress your faith and lower your expectations and water down your dreams? Are you thinking, it's not really what I want, but it's good enough? Listen, God meets you at the level of your expectations. If you expect nothing, you're going to receive nothing. Good enough is not your destiny. Therefore, it should never be your expectation. God put greatness in you, and he wants that greatness as your expectation. He doesn't satisfy the doubting soul, the negative soul, or the passive soul. Psalm 107, 9 says, God satisfies the thirsty soul with good things. Don't fall into the trap of going through life with no thirst, no passion, or no expectations. Don't think your best days are behind you. Get thirsty for more again. Start dreaming again. Start believing again. Start hoping again. God is still in the make it happen business. When you're thirsty, miracles are set in motion. When you're hungry, the heavens shift. God will make things happen that you can't make happen. God longs to be gracious to you. God always exceeds our greatest expectations. Believe and declare that you are thirsty for God to bring out the greatness that he put in you. God bless you.